What's going on guys? Quick little tool haul video here. So I went down to a local Hulk Herb Freight. Uh, picked up this 20 volt cordless glue gun. That was the only thing I was really intending to go for. There's a the part number. This thing is actually really great. Power button right there that illuminates. Has a little work light. Um, but yeah, I, I normally use this to uh, glue the little mounts for the Christmas lights. To the brick and it works great because at the end of the season i just pull them right off and they come off all together but uh, i normally use um, this thing here from dewalt and this is a good a good unit too um the only problem is it's corded so when i gotta get on the roof or up higher um that becomes a pain so this thing's only 19 dollars at Harbor Freight, so the price was really, really worth it. It's really well made, um, so these are standard sizes. So there's that, and I just run it off of this uh, three amp hour battery. Um, let's see, I used it yesterday, and battery's still fully charged. So there's that. Picked up a. Heat shrink assortment. What I'm going to do with this is actually uh, utilize some of these little pockets, make a little electrical kind of to go kit to throw my bag over there. So that's for that. Picked up a couple boxes of gloves. These are on sale for $4.99. So they're only 5 mil, which they kind of tear easily, but um, they're cheap. So I don't want to spend a lot of money on gloves. All right, so ended up picking these up. These are this is the three eighths, thirteen inch breaker bar from Icon. There's part number right there. So I am using the Icon lineup right now for my to go bag. So went ahead and wanted to throw this in there, and then the twenty five inch breaker bar. And this should pretty much cover any aspect of any stubborn bolts. That I'll run into. Um, I'll keep this, keep this one probably in the bag, and then this one probably in the vehicle for whenever I need to bust this out. So there's that. Went ahead and grabbed up this uh, hose plier. I like this one because it's short. Um, normally, oh, we'll get into that in a second too. Um, I have the longer ones from Titan. These are good too. And the reason I like these is just one, uh, you can pull off hoses with them, but two, they're great for electrical connectors. So you can push that little pin in and you don't really have to squeeze them too hard, um, but it's just enough where, you know, the ones that get caked with dirt and grease and stuff, and they end up, they're really stubborn. So these make them really easy to pull off and they kind of just pull off with it. So that's the reason I got that, that I go in the bag as well too. Got this one off the tool swapper. Uh, paid a hundred bucks for this set. And the reason I got these, I have the gear wrench set here, and then I have the uh, cheaper set from I think ABN or whatever. But when I, when I saw these, I mean, these will last forever. But I wanted a nice set just to keep in my box for personal use, uh, where you know, I didn't want to bring these to go. So the other set I'll I'll bring to go to do jobs off site. But so if I lose those, I'm not gonna worry too much with these. I'll definitely keep these at home in the garage here. So really happy about that. So that's my tool haul. Alright guys, I'll take care.